Today we're going to teach you how to grill a turkey right in time for Thanksgiving. It's gonna be beautiful. Let's get started. To make marinade infusion, you're gonna use the following. Um, first, you'll me melt the butter, and you need two tablespoons of butter. And you're gonna melt it on low heat. Now that the butter is melted, we're gonna turn the stove off and add the half a cup chicken broth. Then we're gonna add one tablespoon lemon juice. Now we're adding half a teaspoon ground black pepper and half a teaspoon garlic powder. Then we're gonna mix it all up. We're gonna add half a teaspoon salt. To make a glaze for the turkey, we're gonna crush one clove of garlic and we're gonna add three tablespoons of butter. Next, we're gonna add just a little bit of lemon juice, a touch of salt, and a little bit of black pepper. And then we're gonna add a little bit of olive oil and mix it all up. So we're gonna inject the marinade into the turkey and we're going to do it about 15 or 16 different places. Yes, you want to inject the turkey on both sides uh, to make sure that the turkey is juicy, moist and not dry all over. So just be sure to inject it in as many places as possible but don't overdo it at first. All right, next we're gonna salt and pepper the turkey. You can also use other spices to uh, season it. We wanna spread it around so that it's all, so that it's even. You also want to season the inside of the bird before you stuff it with anything. All right, next we're going to put an onion quartered inside. All right, so next you're going to cover the, the turkey with the sauce that we prepared. All right, so what we have here is one heat zone. I have the charcoal off to the side. Uh, we're gonna cook this on indirect heat. And I'm gonna cover it uh, with the lid right now and let the temperature get up to about 375 degrees. All right, the temperature is now up to 350. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and put in the turkey. Uh, the temperature is gonna be fine as long as it's between 350 and 400 degrees. And we can adjust it by opening these vents um, if we need more air or closing the vent if we need less air. All right, I'm gonna throw in, I'm actually gonna throw in some wood chips just for some smoke and flavor. All right, we're gonna check the grill in about an hour to make sure the temperature is right and throw in some additional charcoal as well. All right, it's now been an hour and we're gonna open up the lid and add some more charcoal to make sure that this grill stays hot. The turkey looks great. I want to 
gonna throw in. I'm also gonna throw in some more wood chips to keep that smoke coming. And we'll check back on it in about an hour. All right, we've had it on here for about three hours now, occasionally adding charcoal to it. Let's uh, put in the temperature gauge and find out uh, the internal meat temperature. And we want to make sure that on the thigh, it's at least 160 degrees. Okay, it looks like it's over 160 degrees, so we'll be safe to eat this. Woohoo!